Oh, hey y'all, welcome back. We're gonna go muscadine foraging. I don't know how well you can see these uh, up and behind me, but I think they're ready to go. I've been watching these um, muscadines here in the property. So now we're gonna go uh, try to find some out in nature. <laughs> well, national forest. Uh, so here we go. Welcome to Noah's Ark in Saw Homestead. I'm going off the grid. But yeah, I got a couple of nice uh, vines here. Surely you can uh, see all those. And uh, they look like they're uh, most of them are ripe. And we're not expecting rain for a little while longer. So some of them actually starting to turn, uh, uh, get a little wrinkly. So I'm guessing this is about the right time to go get them. All right, I found my first pit stop. Cut off of Highway 7 here. There's a good little bundle over there. Oh man, look how big these are. Man, these are big ones. All right, not bad for our first stop. Let's keep moving. Oh yeah, look at all these. I think I hit the mother load. Oh man. Oh yeah, I got all these just from this one vine. I'm gonna save, uh, I'm not gonna pick it clean. I'm gonna save some for the, for the critters. How many did you get over there? Let's see your bag. Oh yeah, look at that. All right. Yeah. Now getting somewhere. Yeah, I think what it is up here, when we're on top of the mountain, uh, instead of down in the valley where there's no, um, uh, no sunlight. So, up here, this whole row right here is full of them. Now look at this tree, all bent. Cause this might be the mother load. And, oh my gosh. <laughs> there are just clumps of them in here. Gee. <laughs> What in the world? I got the Tuma. Ooh, can you see all those? I'm gonna shake them. I'm afraid they're gonna hit me in my eye. Hold on. Uh. All right, second day. I got a little bit over a bucket. I mean, a half a bucket. And this is from the uh, other day. So I would say I definitely have over. We're pretty much five gallons. Man, I'm gonna make me some uh, muscat iron wine, some jellies. See how I do. Okay, doing a little side adventure. Here's a Fort Mountain Bluff. Uh, it looks like there's some uh, primitive camping. Campfire there, campfire over there. Yeah, it's a pretty cool looking place. I see uh, different chains mounted on the uh, cliff there. Looks like uh, it's good for mountain climbing. Doing some, uh, yeah, different anchors in. Yeah, there's a big fire ring in here. Looks almost like a cave. Man. Huh, I bet if I dig that out, who knows, that might actually be a cave down in there. Man, <laughs> look at that smoke. Oh uh, yeah, so. I bet this would have been a cool place to Hang out. 
cool formation. Catch you some water. Oh yeah, there's those uh, uh mad climbing chains, anchors. Huh. Oh yeah, pretty wild. Yeah, I wonder if there's no uh, petroglyphs or anything. Yeah, this is like this would be a good start point to sort of mad climbing. It's like this different. Looks like that'd be uh, kind of okay. A lot and and that looks like it'd be pretty uh, difficult. Yeah, I see the anchors going all the way up. Huh. Woo. <laughs> then you can repel off of that. That'd be fun. <laughs> Oh, that's a dead tree. Ooh, hey for that to fall while camping here. All right, guys, this seemed like a good place to end our Muscadine adventure. Remember, if you don't know what it is, don't eat it. <laughs> Y'all have a blessed day. Thanks.